Why haven't you been answering your phone? Sorry. What's happened? I don't even know where to start. And he just came out with it. Bang. It kind of felt like being shot, actually. If I've ever been shot. That's one thing I've still yet to try. Give it a year or two, eh? You knew all this time? Yeah. You knew what your mum were like? Why do you think he only spent one night with her? God. Oh, whatever. I'll get over it, won't I? So I tell you now. Guilt got to him? Guilt, no. He was being blackmailed by my brother. Rob? Mm. What a family, eh? It's all right, man. It's not going to be a tearful hug and will you walk me down the aisle, Dad? Of course not, but... But what? But you can't ignore the fact he is your father. He's ignored me for 40 years. Can you imagine how different my childhood could have been? Can you? No, I need something stronger than coffee. Oh, Carla. I'll believe it. I'll get rid of them. Yep. It's Aiden. Oh, brilliant. Aiden, isn't it? Look, uh, Carla's not feeling very well. Actually, you know what? Show him up. I can tell him what his dad's really like. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. Why should I protect him? Why don't I get rid of him? You have a bath, and I'll bring your coffee through to you. How is she? She is fine. I, I was worrying about you. Yeah, well, there's no need, you know. <clears throat> so, how was um, Hope's scan? She was very brave, as always. And they'll know tomorrow if the tumour shrunk? Indeed. They think she's been looking better recently, though. I know from experience not to try and predict the outcome in these situations. So, have, have you made a decision? How many times can I try and change the subject? <laughs> OK, he's just concerned. Mm. OK, well, I don't know what I'm going to do. You know, because right now I just feel angry and more angry. Uh, have you made a decision as regards Aidan and Kate? I suggested it might be best not to tell them. I, I agree. Oh, OK. But I'm glad you both agree on what's best for me. I can't, eh? Well, why shouldn't I tell them? I mean, give me one good reason why I shouldn't march over there right now. Because it's Johnny you're angry with. They've done nothing wrong. And hurting them won't make you feel any better. How do you know what's going to make me feel better? Because, you know, I'm the only one that's living in my head right now, so if you'll kindly just both butt out. You know what? I just want Johnny to feel one ounce of the pain that I have spent my whole life drinking to forget. That's what I want. <laughs>